Well, everybody, this is a show 250. Non-stop. I will say this speech over and over again to the day I die, but this company has run, on this run, weekly, sometimes many shows in a week, extra shows, long and short, every week for the last 250 weeks, everybody. That is an accomplishment, and I dare anyone to equal it, ever. Mind you, it's going to take them nearly five years to do it, if they're starting, so there's that. But Wrestling Jesus was challenged by Jesse the Fiend, but we're also giving him a shot at the belt, which might disturb the plans of Jerry, General Jerry. We want to give him as much opportunity. We want to give him a shot. Uh oh. Just the beam. Jerry doesn't even see this, but uh oh. Oh no! Jesse the Fiend getting a, a getting a bit of a head start because he knows how they roll. Uh oh, Jesse. You are not maneuvered by the Canadian. Oh, he's giving the fiend what for, but the fiend is no slouch. Oh! Super fiend punch. He has had... Countless, countless titles. He even had world title. You gotta believe this one's over. And only a one count. Oh, dear! The fiend having his way. His shoulders are down. No, a kick um, down. Tried to go for a quick pin, but it didn't go. What a strike. Uh oh. Oh, yeah. Wrestling Jesus rising again. Stumble here. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid. Yeah, the fiend. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, he's got to re... Um... Oh, he did it. Elbow drop. By God. Ooh, what impact. Oh, dear. Looks like he may have let his guard down there for a moment. Yeah, he's going up again. Yeah, but it looks to me like he still has plenty of energy in that body. Oh! I wouldn't look too much into this. Wrestling one. Jesus. This he's got go. his title shot. That wasn't even close to three. But, uh, and we, and we forced the issue because Wrestling Jesus wanted his ops. Now he's getting them. He's got a prestigious title from the DWI universe. Dominating shoulder tackle. And oh, oh, too long of a trip. Uh oh, oh my goodness, what trip so slam. He's going for it all. He's looking at it. Oh man, jarring headbutt. That one definitely hurt Cole. He's lining him up. It's not going well for the bean. Uh oh, this could end. Oh, that's the impact. Can he finish the job? And going for He's the pin. Down. One. Two. Oh no! Wrestling Jesus takes down another one. He's had his losses against Boston and Steve, but oh, the other ones. The Fiend started out well, but oh, check him out here. Eventually.
And he is going to have plenty of time to rest. He's getting it done here. For his title shot, which I don't know. What would Jerry do? Great moment. I really enjoyed every minute of this. Jerry's got all this pent-up frustration. And what if WJ takes it away from him? Then what? Here is your winner. Well, I love the man, but he's taking a weird turn. That's an impressive win right there. That's the kind of win that makes you feel good about yourself. Guys, it sounds like we can all agree that was an extremely impressive win. Well, we're going to go on to Tia's very interesting gauntlet. He's going to pick up titles all over the place. We got these titles, very special titles. One of which he already already has, but he's going against Dusty Rhodes. And he'll be doing, that's the All-American title. We had that title here. Dusty Rhodes representing. And we'll see what Kia can do here. He's going to be going through a few at a time. He's calling himself Kia Omega, who is known for his uh, Kenny Omegas, you know, title gathering. Puts his title on the line every time. So he's putting his title on the line tentatively. I don't know what's going to happen if he doesn't have that title. Seven times in this show alone. Seven title defenses. I don't know how this is going to work. Is it going to work? That's a lot. He's putting a lot on the line. Comes the American dream. Oh, he has a title I don't know, but we have someone worthy. Going against legends about time I told you the thing you know. Too many people do not see they kill themselves going insane. I mean, they're too many people do not know bondage is over the human race. He's going through all the Tentatively, the more he succeeds, the more he's gonna have to go through. think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup and Man, down already Kia not having a good so start great matches and this one is definitely among the oh most oh kick. oh right in the back you know American dream 
Oh, and he misses. Maybe he should be wearing all that. Oh, oh, just smacking him, smacking him, smacking him. Oh, and he avoids one. Oh, the running bulldog. Oh, and oh, he took too long. Thought about it too long. Caught up in his own little world. And he is victorious. And he now has the American title, the all-American title. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. And he's already got another match coming up right now. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your all-star United and There it is. States Couple titles in his possession at once. An amazing contest comes to a close following a decisive pinfall victory. And it's Psycho Sid who has the Beastie Championship because he was uh, abandoned, but you know he got it. Saxton, get out from under the table. Sorry. And introducing the champion from West Memphis, Arkansas, weighing in at 317 pounds, he is the Hundred Champion, Andre Chandler. No, he's not even gonna wait for this. Whipped off the title and Kia Omega. Going with it. This is a sturdy, tall guy. Sid, vicious, Sid psycho, psycho. I don't know what he's called. Oh my! Uh oh, they're going at it. Pretty sure there's a count on this. I don't know, but he's running to the ring either way. Here we go, back inside the ring. Uh oh. Elbow right to the back of the neck. Oof. Here, what have you got yourself into? What a stomp. Good grief. Elbow drop. Big time. I'm kicking him around. Uh oh. Oh no. The champion into the cover. And the champ kicks out. Could take more than that. Oh! Oh, wow. That's brutal. 250 shows. This is very special. Uh oh. Oh, he's got him rolled up! Whoa, 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 whoa. One. No, wait. Uh oh. Uh oh. One. Two. Three. Oh my god. That was a fluke move. You can't fake that stuff. These superstars put on quite a show. Here's another look. And I always enjoy watching him. Here's where it got really funny. Rolled him up. One. And then he rolled him up and he just couldn't get out of it. That was a crazy pin. Well, another belt. Head. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be... And uh, there you go. He's got a second belt added. Now he's going to get King Booker for the blood, sweat, and tears. Because Lord knows in this business there's blood, sweat, and tears. And we'll see how this goes. King Booker, not a slouch. There he is. 
Yeah, Omega waiting for him. Blood, sweat, and tears. This is going to be a brutal match, but oh, oh, he's just throwing down the center. He is going to go at it. Tia, watching him flying at him like a demon from hell. Yeah, that did take No formalities here. Still running around with that cape on. Oh! And he throttled him. And the match continues. Getting a bit chaotic there with that cape on. They had to take it off. And Kia <coughs> reasserting his control. Oh, he's wrenching on that arm. King Bucker. Blood, sweat, and tears. He has had many. He has done many. Oh, what impact. Oh. Wicked clothesline. King Booker doing that thing he does. Bravado. Ooh. Soft ahead than we thought, and oh, he reverses. Tonight is his chance to prove it. I wouldn't call for the medics just yet, Cole. He still appears to be in pretty good shape. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making a uh -oh. very big mistake. Mark Kia Omega going up and oh, right into a pin. And one, a two. Oh, he didn't go so quickly. He's playing with him now. I'll tell you what. Oh, check that out. Ooh, neck breaker. Nobody does it quite like shoulders on the back. And now, one, two. Oh, we got him that time. And, and oh, look at that. Another, match. another belt. Well, they don't call it extreme rules for nothing, guys. Let's take another look. That's three belts he's already gathered up, and, and he's going to get a break. Because there's a tag team match coming up. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your pure, ultra-violent, triple crown, and Keith Ahmed Omega Omega. A very decisive victory here tonight. Doubt, well, that's a third belt. Guys on the WWE he is Boston really gathering up the belts. Right he has uh, four more to go through. But first, we have this tag team tornado tag grudge match where these two who had their gold taken away by Madhouse and Madhouse are on the way to a tag team championship match at war. But they're going to be dangling with these guys. And they have other um, people that want to take them on. Come the um, come July, when it's going to be the road to the Brit Wigger Beach Bash. That's my thing. Thing that YTWE 18 Plus did in my honor, and they got the most views ever they'll ever get. Ever, 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 ever. I mean, I don't know how they're ever going to get more. They're going to have to do something really drastic. But Madhouse, and we saw Joshua X has um, um, access to some female talent, which I have uh, shown interest in, and I would like to see them, one way or another, come to the FBXW. We need... The following contest is a no disqualification We need some female talent.
And there's AJ Storm. Lost his belt to oh. Joshua X, I guess it was. I get confused who got what from who. Champions came out of the darkness. Oh, Scott Adams. Scott Adams and Rob Hallsworth. Oh, yeah, but here we are. Everything's gathered up now, and that's a two on two, no tagging. It's going to be mayhem. Here we go, fellas. I've been looking forward to this one for quite Ooh. some time. Joshua X. And uh, AJ Stone going at it while Bloka uh, and Psycho Clown go at it. They're not the respective people that took it from each other, but um, well, there it is. Here he goes. Oh! Madhouse compromised. Bloka doesn't need to be too affected. Joshua X, yeah, he's in a bit of a situation. submission and good thing that could have been disastrous comes up big with the reversal oh boy he is rolling oh boy he is rolling Bloka's out of the ring and Psycho the Clown picking him up he's not looking like himself here and it's so hard to create space for oh, yourself man. in a tornado tag team match such as this and he's been gambling quite a bit here tonight there's plenty of reward that goes along with being outside the ring as much as he has been. Wow, I thought he was a goner. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh, 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 Joshua is just going at AJ Storm. Oh! Bloka getting it done in uh, by Psycho the Clown. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. He's talking his opponent. Uh oh, oh, he's cranking on him. Oh, he's cranking on him. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And Bloka just... Did he submit? What happened? Oh, wow. Joshua X just a little late. My God. Guess the uh, attack of the uh, champions made a difference. Look at him go. He really put on a great show.
Madhouse having a bit of a wrinkle in their situation, but it does not affect their contendership. Here are your winners, the real deal, AJ Storm and well, Psycho. Bit of a measure of revenge there. What we just saw there was a doctorate class in tag team competition. They just took the game to a whole other level. And I'm willing to bet we won't see a tornado tag team match like that in quite some time. Well, we're back to the second round of uh, potentially belts cleaning up. Ones. I mean, once he loses his belt, he has nothing to vie for for the other belts. Really wouldn't be any point. But he's going on his fourth match now this this night. He went three in a row. And this is, uh, you know, not one of the bigger people, but he has that, uh, I think it's dedication. It's the dedication belt. The things that... Uh, he has done in his time not not uh, given enough attention but he has done so much in his time I am champion See how this one goes. Someone more size. He might have two titles. Because you know, Kim must be a little bit on the fatigue side. This should be an incredible matchup. I mean, both men have extensive offensive repertoire. And already, lasting endurance and an insatiable not appetite doing as well as he could be. One. And I can't help but get the feeling that this is going to be one of those matches people will be talking about for a long time to come. Oh, we well, missed completely that. That did not work. Uh oh, flat deck. That kick will stop you in your tracks. What a stomp. Good grief. Kia picking him up. Oh, wallop. Oh, he's bringing it. He's bringing it. The champion into the cover. My 
Montez Ford quickly getting the shoulder up. Not even close. Splash in the corner. And oh wow. dear, Kia. Uh oh. Like the look in Kia's eye, in for some trouble. Oh. He's going for the pin. One no. out. Catch him off guard there, I guess. Remarkable. Going to be woozy after that impact. Oh, nasty impact. Splash in the corner. Wow. The oh, Montez. To the top turnbuckle. Going up again. Kia not doing very well at all. And oh, oh, and he landed right on his bottom. Oh, and he got kicked down. Too bad it was awfully executed, though. Oh, an incredible sit out. The champion into the cover. Uh oh. Oh, and he tried to kick out, but it just did not happen. Wow. These, all these different people. Just, wow. Man, oh man, look at that. Every single minute of this one was memorable. He has had another belt. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your prestigious classic and key Ahmed Omega. Omega. Put it in the books, and there was no question about that one. I don't make the matches, but if I did, and he has yet I'd put another back in the match. Ring. ASAP. What an amazing. None other than the history champion, the historical champion, Rick Flair. Dear Lord. Rick Flair. Sort of in the middle of his prime now. A lot going on. Not making a point that he wasn't booked or anything, but you know, things going on. And, well, they have, they had a mid-month match there. And Ric Flair, he likes to play the mind games, he likes to play the little cheeky beady. And Kia's all wise to that. This is a 14, 16 time, I don't know, world champion. Oh, playing that game. That didn't work for him. Not this time. Oh! Snapped him. Uh oh. Set him up. Uh oh. Neck breaker. Oh dear, Rick Flair's not even out of his robe. He might have it. Is he done? Momentum not on the Nature Boys side. He's a true champion. I suspect he has plenty of fight. And that is it. He That's just beat him. Out of the blue. We got our money's worth for that one. Take a look.
Unbelievable. And you know, he still has one more in this round to do. He is not quite done. Without even breaking a sweat, this one is over. There's nothing more pure than picking up a win in a good old fashioned one. Yes, how many belts now? I'm almost lost crowd. Count. And he's going against Andre the Giant for the larger than life. Otherwise known as the Big Head Championship. And uh, he, is, he is now... Wow, we've never seen Kia like this before. Oh my God! Look who's on Raw! <laughs> and there he is. Big Show is a big man, but Under the Giant is a legend. And, introducing and that's who they the want. Champion the legend. From Grenoble, France. Weighing in at 520 pounds. He is the heavyweight what a worldwide presence. non-stop champion. The eighth, eighth wonder, wonder of the world, world truly is a sight to Giants. behold. This is going to be, wow, like late in his run here. Andre's legacy is so huge and so And he's going to have to somehow WWE even had a beat him. Named after him. Let alone not be beaten. The Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal. One of the most dominant, one of the most imposing. It men just we've gets worse seen. and worse. And oh! Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going that to be did not work. traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. If you haven't hit record yet, oh, dear. might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. No, this is not working. It is impossible to escape the intimidating aura of the eighth wonder of the world, Andre the Giant. Now you and I can't dispute that, Saxon. There is no greater force than the seven-foot-four, five hundred pound giant what a strike he is not having a good time Bang oh there. he got lucky there made him think that was a good idea he's looking at it is he done no he lets him out yeah i think he knew he wasn't going to get the submission there Champ not looking good right now. He's going to need to find a oh. way. Oh! I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. Is it not going well? This superstar is dangerous both inside and outside the ring. Andre the Giant on some He is snap. trying all that he can, but this is really like banging his head on a wall. You're going to absorb some punishment in a wrestling match. It just goes along with the territory, and he knows that. I doubt he's all that concerned at this point. You seem more motivated than ever heading into this match. Which makes oh, he's actually got him against the ropes. Uh-oh. Using those ropes as an advantage. Oh, and oh, now he's going to take a chance. Oh, and he knocked the ref down. That wasn't a good idea. Here he goes. And he gave him a good splash. And now he's going to give him... Oh, he's going to give him something. Is it going to work? Oh, he got it around. Oh, my God. Take advantage. One. Two. Oh, my God. This boy needs a rest. Let's look back on the action from the last match. No doubt Unbelievable. That's game six belts he's won so far.
Ladies and gentlemen, here is your heavyweight, worldwide, non-stop, and key, Ahmed Omega, Omega. Wow. Unbelievable, folks. When you get a one-on-one -on -one match like that, you hate to see one of them come up short. And That's he'll be, uh, a couple matches later, but Dog God taking on, by request, Damian Cross, who has wanted Dog God. Now, Dog God is... <laughs> Successful wrestler, but he is a very maniacal man. Oh God, just begging him to hurry it up. Oh, what's he doing? He's looking for some extreme uh, tools, but... Oh, and he gives him a spear. Now he's looking for some more uh, fun there. Oh, that didn't work out. Dark God and Damien Cross. Oh dear. Oh, nice shot. Oh, Dark God. Qualifications and no oh, pulverize there. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. Up and down. What a slam. This might be it. Oh, my. Dog oh God. Oof. As Corey mentioned, Dog oh God wants to do some damage, but. Oh, oh dear. To steel to fire Is this going to work? Oh, and he got knocked out of the way. And when that's the case, it's not a matter of if you're going to get hurt. It's a matter of how badly you're going to get hurt. Double axe handle smash. Without a doubt, this is a volatile situation, guys. WWE superstars are dangerous. Quite the weapon. mess going on out there. In an environment like this, and who knows what you're liable to see. Knee stop! That'll ruin your leg. Damian Cross having his way with Dog God. Tell me, just how much strength does carrying your opponent around like this take? 
Uh oh. This way, Cole. Oh! Would never be able Doggone to is a bloody I mess, literally. This point on volatility and the volatility of this match. But what I think oftentimes gets overlooked is the mental anguish that goes along with competing in a match like this. Oh, boo hoo. Cry me a river, Saxton. These competitors knew exactly what they were getting themselves into when they chose this profession. If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially no rules are one giant free big move coming. Wait for it. Big head. Oh! Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Oh, God, may not have been knowing what he was thinking of. Counter here. Set it up. But I was no, but Dog God, making a bit of a comeback. Describe this match firing. It's one giant free for all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture on these superstars. It is cold. And unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury, sometimes serious injury. He's making a statement here with this attack. He wants no part of the outside. Doc Odd. Trying to hold his own, but Damian Cross is furious. Oh, oh! He may have a may have a chance yet. He's a bloody mess. Oh, and down flat on his face. The better chance they have of victory. This may not be good. Look at oh! Him. And Damian Cross misses. He could pin his opponent right here! It's over! No trouble getting out of that one. Too yeah. soon. He nope. wants no Pulls him in there so he has a little bit of time. As Byron mentioned, innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor can't be adverse to taking action outside the ring. By oh. no means is this He's going outside. He's going up top. Out. And uh, what's he going to do here? You still win this oh! Tricky. By pinfall or submission. Oh, by the steps. And he knocked him good with those steps. Say, watching this match, I'm definitely seeing similarities to yeah, the going up. 16 Extreme Rules match. Oh, and he got knocked Roman off. That's not good. WWE World Heavyweight Championship against AJ Styles. Scoop slam! Dog dog kicking away, he's going in. What's he doing? He's going in? No, oh, he's slowing down. Oh! Oh! Someone knocked that step with something. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Oh! Almost five past, years this has run weekly non stop. The evolution, the much match, thanks guys, to Scott Adam. Just as devastating the second time around. Going for the big one. Uh oh. Oh. Our fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? He's got the shoulders down. There's the pinfall. And Doc Ogg is down for the count. Now let's get another look at some of the high points of that one. He's getting after it here. Yeah, he's putting in the work. He ain't playing here. He was on point the entire match, as you can see here.
Here is your winner, the villain, Damien C. And there's your winner via pinfall. That was simply a case of one guy determined to prove his dominance over another. What a match that was, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us. He is final stage. Facing the man who he mocks with his name, Kia Omega. None other than Kenny Omega. Not waiting and oh clobbers him. He is furious that this is a man who is mocking his title sweeps. And one, two. Oh, that was almost embarrassing for Kenny Omega. And uh oh, oh, flat on top. Oh, nasty impact. The champ's oh. starting to stumble a bit. To be expected, though, it's not like he's in there with a slouch, guys. By the looks of things, I don't think he expected his opponent to be as motivated as he clearly is here tonight. Oh, and Kenny Omega giving him what for. Oh! Scoop slam! The champ to the top turnbuckle. Oh, moonsault! Man, did you see that? Oh, my dear. Oh, no, it was Kia. Kia's sweep done. Nope. Now, still too fresh. Can he make it doesn't mind using that belt? Escapes trouble there. Uh oh. Guys, you never know what you're gonna see in a match like this. Oh. Oh no, not there. Oh. Finished him um, in the wrong place. Boom! Right to the face. Nobody got clocked. As Corey mentioned, Daniel Bryan versus Kane in 2014 provided scenes we never thought we'd see. Most notably for me was Bryan carrying Kane back to the ring via a forklift. That's right up there, Michael. But let's oh go. my let's God! The the into the cover. One, no. no. Nah, not yet. Too early. He wants no part of the outside.
Of course, extreme rules matches have oh, been and he just came at him with that bat. I think the bat landed on his crotch. A vicious attack. Oh boy, he is rolling. Kenny is looking for the more ammo. Oh, that didn't work. As Byron mentioned, Lesnar's attack on Cena in 2012 was without question gruesome. And furthermore, oh, Kenny I just been fallen. John Cena manhandled like he was on that night. Oh no, and a reverse DDT. This one is over. Nobody can sustain a drop like that, Michael. Time to flip it. Face oh! It. That's what he was looking for, Michael. I think See that again. Another one outside. And he's pinned him in the ring. Very quickly, which superstars have what it takes to truly get extreme. The champion into the cover. One, two. Oh my God! And the victory. Seven matches in one. Mm. We've got some time. Decent sized show. Highlights from that one. Three in a row. Three in a row. And then the finale against the man who sweeps titles. Who could forget this? Oh, I can't believe this. Check him out here. And I always enjoy watching him perform. Kia. You heard the ring announcer. This one's over. And here's your winner. To get the pinfall victory over such a high quality opponent is incredibly impressive, Michael. What a great match we just. Go, go. Well, here we have go, a nice little bonus before the two big main events. Go, we have go. a battle royal. Some of the favorites from all throughout. Go, go. Let's go kind of around. We have Gabo. From Tate, we have Dark Leader and Canaron from the DWI. We have Bosty and Bonnie Green Entertainment, whatever. Johnny Rotten and Zed. We have quite the. We, we would look like more, but. And here we have the match starting off. Dark Leader and Aaron Ash is going right at it. Monsters here. This could end it in a hurry. Bonnie. Oh, oh Scabber almost went. Beautiful technique, but he's got to capitalize now. And uh, oh, Bosti has Zed. Oh, he dumps him unceremoniously. Doc may be giving Aaron Acid a run for his money. Uh oh. And Step now, oh, oh, he gets Zed good. Oh, and now Bosti dumps BGE. Oh my god, Bosti's on a tear. Someone's gonna be black and blue to oh, oh, and Aaron Acid just been dumped. Nice. Maybe by Canaron? Not sure. Nobody gets up from that hole. Ooh, that kick could be Still a got the DWI changer. representatives. Oh, oh Tanneron throwing Bosky around. Oh, and Scabble's just been dumped. Incredible. This might be it. Oh my. Boom. What a strike. Oh, and a DDT by Zed. And now we got Canaron and Dark Leader. Zed and Bosty. Bosty is still in there. Dark Leader. Oh, snap man by Canaron. Not the greatest person to be going up against Bosty. But Bosty is a very seasoned veteran. Quite. Oh, where's he going? Where's he going? Don't go so close. Uh oh. He's not in a good spot here, guys. Oh, he and he just got a good, solid clothesline over the ropes. Forcefully delivered. And then Canaron lost his precious Canadian belt. Oh, and that was not a good idea for uh, Bosty. Canaron's just going to let him. Oh, wow. Canaron's going to watch him. Oh, that was a mistake. 
giant choke slam. Can he what a stop. Good grief. But he's got to capitalize now. Oh, Canron. Chopping away at the Redwood tree. Uh -oh. Here we go. Oh! oh! Whoa! What's he going to do now? He is so known for that. Those two may be working together. Avoids trouble there. No reverses it. Uh oh. Not today. Running bulldog Running by Bosty. And Canaron rolling Tom out of right danger, but. Oh, mm. what a shot. Now Bosty trying to get him up over the ropes the hard way. Really oh, hard boy, way. He is rolling. Oof. Nope, oh, and he hops over. Neck breaker. Here he goes. What's this now? That's not gonna get him over the ropes. There it is. I knew it was Broken a bridge suplex. Uh oh. Yeah, you don't see a slam like that. Yeah, neck breaker on Kenron. Frosty oh, oh, showing his superiority. No, but now the anger of uh, retaliation. Russian leg sweep. Nicely done. Never good to roll like that. But I guess you can't really be considered going nice. over the ropes. You got to go over the ropes first before that's even, you know. Worse. Oh, now Nick Breaker on Tanneron. No, he reverses it. Go, oh, and he tried to do a cut or something. Oh, and a flying right foot to the face. He's making a statement here with this attack. A second time. Oh, he was going at it. He loved going for that. That's called making a statement, Cole. Man, I just lost all respect. Bossy checking out things. What a oh, from behind. Uh oh, oh boy, he is setting rolling. him up. Uh oh, oh. Oh no, he flopped over. I'm having a hard time figuring out and what they're going to do next. Help? Oh, he's helping. Canron. He's dangling and wiggling and flailing and oh, no, man. he is he not out yet. Wide array of offense from anywhere in the ring. Got two DWIs here. Knocked and Fosty right in the middle. Feet. Yeah, no kidding. When this guy's on, oh, look out. He's gonna try and do something, but to no avail. Oh. Oh dear. And I wouldn't be surprised if he had nothing left at this point. He oh, and he just tossed him over really after Bill beating him down now. Right oh! Now. And at this point, it might be a dog leader. How, how is this going to work out? Reaches empty first. You got to believe this one's over. Flashback! No. Oh. Breaker. Big giant. Oh, oh, oh dear. Oh, wearing him down. Looking at it here. Oh wow, Canaron at the mercy the of the God. Wow. Not where and he's he going to. Right oh, hey, he got himself into this mess. There's the last competitor eliminated. Canaron pulled that off. There's always a chance that would happen. Look at some of the I was kind of hoping it would happen, and by God, it happened. Oh, I can't believe this. Brom Hallsworth did the same thing Look to win that go. prize of being the tag this partner and great future moment. tag champion. And he did he it really there, folks. Great show. Canaron pulled that off. He was so doomed. Here is your winner, and there's our bicentennial and a half Omega. champion. Wow, what an amazing performance we saw here in this elimination match. To be the last one standing after such a grueling encounter is Congratulations, beyond you amazing, Michael. Sly devil. Wow, I don't think... Well, we go on to this really sizable match. This is like a co-main event. Key already blowing our minds. But Steve the Gamble teaming with his all-time favorite. And someone who he says actually changed the Fed for all the better. And going against L.S., in a very friendly match. I mean, Steve the Gamble loves, I love LS.
rugged. With his uh, special belt, he'll be uh, flashing that around. Show 250. He had the three times. His friend, the four times. And RD, he did the one time. They are going on. Tag champions. Especially Buckle Rock. One of the greatest e feathers, Scott Adams. And he was. He was picked on a special list. So that's something. And they will be joined by Steve the Gamble, of all people. showed their disdain for the madhouse. And here is the owner joining someone who alters the course of the game. And a man who's been with it the longest.
Jump? No, it didn't go well. Rob all the way, he's a veteran, but... Yeah. Oh, wow. And the one just came at him. And get ready, because this one is underway. And he's a proud guy. That title may not be on the line here, but that doesn't mean he doesn't want to win this match. You've got to believe this one's over. Drop kick. Beautiful. No. Scott Adams isn't going down. Oh my god! That was like a major bomb. Oh wow, the one and the one in Scott Adams, holy smoke. Oh, they just knocked the ref down. Bloody hell. If things don't change in a hurry, this has all the makings of a short evening for him. Oh, and the one stopping him. Oh. He's starting to feel it here. And you know all three of the superstars he's up against won't back down at any point during this match. It's hard oh, to and the one point, but perhaps the he's taking it to him. Of this match is too much for him oh, to overcome. Man. Harsh impact. What are they going to do here? Bad intentions for uh -oh. sure. One of the great tag teams. And oh my god. That is quite the maneuver. Oh, wow. And the one tag, but... Wow. The effing lord. Rob Hallsworth doing that. Cutter off a powerbomb. I think I was out of PKO. Oh wow, that didn't work. RD and uh, Rob Holsworth don't often meet. Nailed it. Pretty sure Ellis had the tag last. Scott's back at it. Rugged is it to get in there. One has totally gone in there. Audi clearly in there. And wow. He's not as big as the one, so oh. He could always slap that RKO on him. Boink. Tagged in. Oh rugged. Former three time champion. Oh! And rugged outside. Things are going on. Oh, targeting the stomach. Ring rattling. He's not looking good here. At this point, I'd say he's probably better off taking a tag than one of his partners. Consider me wildly unimpressed with his performance here tonight. I mean, he's just getting destroyed in there. He's not looking like himself right now, and I hate to say it, but this might be the beginning of the end for him here. Scott giving rugged hell. Oh, oh. Such a tough target. Too quick for him there. Very difficult position to be in right now. Yeah, situations like this usually don't end very pleasantly. This might be it. Oh my. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. Big time impact from way up high. Looks like he's starting to tire. It appears his opponent has his number right now. This is a wild tag team match here. There are times during a six-man tag match where the hostility between two teams overflows. The result is complete chaos. And all six superstars These two going at it. Outside. And many times outside the ring. Rugged. A little fresher. Oh, 
But if you're one of the legal competitors in the ring during that time, you must return to the ring before the referee's 10 count or risk being counted out and lose the match for your team. Byron, you talked about the moment in six-man tag matches when all semblance of order break. There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. You steal the gamble now and rug it out. This could be the turning point. He is definitely the weak link of this team. Tagged in. Now the one oh look out look out this uh -oh. could be it uh oh is he done oh big submission anyone gonna save him nicely done as he gets probably a good the thing submission. that uh um, calling me surprised Michael I did not see that one coming the one's been so worn down uh oh he stopped him with that beluga kick There are instances when a six-man tag match will feature a team where superstars have not always seen eye to eye. Oh, that did not work. Oh, wow. If that's the case, someone on the team must step up and be the voice of reason so the trio can function as a cohesive unit. What an all-star ensemble in the room oh. right now. Six of WWE's most successful competitors for sure. Corey, earlier you talked about what needs to happen when members of a six-man team have differences or had differences in the past. If the team can't a find a way to get on the same page, they does not want to lose this for the Epic Lord. Someone on the team has to step up and make sure for at least that match, everyone on the team likes the momentum. Yes, we've seen this before. When this guy's on, look uh -oh. at This might not have been a wise move for him here, Michael. He forces his way free. Man, One survives. So much resolve. Lifts give the gamble up and ooh, right against that turn buckle corner. Oh, with an elbow. Oh wow. Gave a spear there. Uh oh. So back and forth. It's not very often you see six superstars of this caliber competing at the It might be cliche, but it's true. Oh! Here. It ain't over. About to do a, it's over. about to do a stunner. Uh oh. Oh, running power bomb. Running sit down One power bomb. I don't know. That's not always the case. He's being dragged. Really close to his corner, though. Not today. Nope, reverses it. This can go a variety of different ways, Corey. Lift him up. None of them are good. Uh oh, hanging him up. And just tossing him aside. Back. His partner wants back in this match, guys. He looks rested and ready to go to me. Steve the gamble lifting him up. Six of double and, uh, uh -oh. Oh, tagging in Rob Oldworth. There's a good chance this oh, is boom. sooner than later. Showing off some of his speed there. Uh oh, he's in trouble here. Yeah, oh dear. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing oh, around. Rob Holdsworth. That is number. Uh oh. Comes a big move, leaping pile driver. Oh dear. He goes for the cover. One, two, no. Rugged stops it. Rob Holsworth, oh, giving a little bit of a a throw. Both teams working well here together. That's not always the. Oh, this isn't right. No. Rob Holsworth doing the shenanigans on the shenanigan masters. Uh oh. Ah, oh, D, what is he doing? He got in there and threw Rob out. What the hell? We've got to be nearing the elimination. Oh! Right kind of knocked Scott off the uh, apron there. Oh, no, hard. Spear there. Kick. 
He has him right where he wants him. Uh oh, Revelator! Nasty impact. I knew it was only a matter of time. Is that enough? One, two. Oh my God! He got out on his own. A little more work than that. Oh! Mighty punch, and that was about it. And scrawling, he jumps for. Uh oh, Scott Adams. Back at Logan. In a major way too. Looking for the win. He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh wow, what happened then? Oh, and slams him. Tag team champions going against former multiple tag team champions. What a stop. Good grief. I mean, Steve, Scott, and Rob have not really worked that much with each other. Scott and Rob, maybe, but not Steve. Both teams working well here together. That's not always the case in a six man tag team match. Oftentimes, uh -oh. personal agendas. Revelator on Scott Adams, my God. That's an upset right there. He's got him covered. And one, two. Oh, wow. The one kind of got. Oh, well, a little too late now. He's getting Steve all over the place. But the one nudged Steve Gamble, but he still got him. Both teams working well here together. That's not always the case in a six man tag team match. Oftentimes, you'll see personal agendas eat the uh -oh. way into the action. Rugged and Rob. Fast reflexes. Oh, wow. A leaping clothesline. This is one hell of a match. How these superstars are even still in this match is beyond me. Especially given how intense the match has been. You've got to believe this Oh, over. leaping kick. And what's he doing? What's he doing? What? After all this, I what is this? These two teams what so was that? Here. This has been incredible. Look at me at this replay. Just this is the second time you did it. After all what this, in the hell? These two teams are still going here. I don't this think I've seen Rob Hallswell do that before, but we saw him do it twice in a row tonight. Not so fast. Irish whip, and it's reversed. And Rob Hallsworth going nuts. Rob Hallsworth. I think Scott rubbed off on Rob Hallsworth. In a good way. Serious damage to the arm being inflicted here. Oh, and he busted him open. Rob Hallsworth is coming up with all kinds of new tricks. He's looking at but game set match. This one is over. Going to the cover. Uh oh. Pen's broken. Oh, up. and Audi stops it and oh Steve the Gamble. Warning him. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. These two going at it. This could be all she wrote. Oh wow, a leaping corner kick. And a leaping, whoa, wow, he's leaping all over the place. And RD going in there again, he's a, uh, the cerebral sniper. Lethal sniper. I mean, referee is down, folks. Oh dear. Tag team champion Rob Hallsworth putting in his dues. He is he is in the main events now. He's looking hapless out there. The six man tag team match certainly seems to be getting the best of him here. He is hurt. Well, on the plus side, he's not the only one in that ring struggling for air right now. Irish whip. 
off the tag. Oh, right to the face. Oh, he turns it around. Nailed it. He gets it with a reversal. Oh, my. Oh, yeah. Gets out of the way of that one. Tagged in. We've seen some old favorites, current favorites, and the Battle Royal. Oh! This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Beautiful technique. Whoa! Down he goes. That was impressive, Cole. This car knee right to the face. That knee is a lethal weapon. Can he finish him off? Oh, a little stomp on Rob. Oh, and he Taking didn't make it to the bottom. Here. Could very well mean the beginning of the end. And there's his speed paying off. What a stomp. Good grief. Right across the back of the neck. And oh, now, my God, what a forearm. That's a jump. Oh, no. We know what Damn this it. is. Is he done? Both teams working well here together. That's not over. No, it's not over yet. Wow. Part of me thought he was going to tap, Cole. Well, it's not going to be pretty. Ooh, what impact. This one's over, guys. Great officiating. As the ref noticed, he was on the ropes. Looks like he wants back in this match. That certainly looks to be the case, Michael. You gotta believe this one's over. Oh. In off the tag. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, and he reverses it. Incredible agility. Oh boy, he is rolling. No, he reverses it. Backbreaker. He's starting to look beaten, guys. And his chances of winning the six-man tag team match appear to be slipping away. That's over at this point. This has been one of the most intense back-and-forth battles I've seen in a long time. Beautiful technique. I'm not sure how much he has left. Boom! Ooh, there's the kick. Second row. The old Panama Sunrise. We may be looking at our winner here, guys. That could have been it right there. Ah, backdrop suplex. Comes in off the tag. Showing off some of his speed there. Quick thinking to avoid that one. Tagged in. Shoulder tackle. Uh -oh. oh, drop kick. Oh. Goes down hard. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Oh boy, he is rolling. Uh-oh. He knows he's in trouble. Uh oh, Scott Adams looking to put a nail in this coffin. Here we go. Here we go. Oh boy, he is rolling. And oh, a mighty slam down. Time to capitalize.
And one, two, oh, and three in the up and Lord and Steve have done it. Now let's get another look at those six superstars going head to head and toe to toe. He ain't messing around. Check this out. Look at him go. And here's the last look at this one. Here are your winners. Scott Adams, Lord Rob Hall, and Steve, Steve, Steven, Steve. The shoulders are down for three, and this one's in the books. I can't say that I'm all that surprised about the outcome. When it's your night, it's your night. Social media has been buzzing over this Raw match ever since it began, and now that it's over, I actually anticipated it. The following champion versus champion contest is a no disqualification match. It is for the World Heavyweight Action Championship. Me like this crowd already. Gotta get the point and I gotta get it quick. I don't got time for another little bit.
Introducing the challenger from New York, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the International Classic Continental Global All-Star Grand Prix Champion, Reese Ling Jesus. Introducing the champion from Elysian Fields, weighing in at 210 pounds, he is the World Heavyweight Action Champion, Michael T. G. Minor. Plant your butts in those seats and get ready. You can expect these superstars to put their bodies on the line to take each other down. These superstars have waited a long time for this match to take place. When I looked at the card for tonight, this one definitely stood out as one you don't want to miss. I think we know what this is. He lets it go. Yeah, I wonder why. He's got the shoulders down. It's going to take more than that to keep his shoulders down. Nah, not yet. Too early. Thunderous slam. Challenger's starting to slow down a bit here. With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all-out battle. Yeah, he's taking on oh, some man. offense here, but that's to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring with. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Mark my Ow. words. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. Now oh, the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Oh, continuing to punish them. He's got him covered. Digging deep for a kick out. Too early in the match to end it. And he releases the hold. I don't think he had it fully locked in. Military. Ooh. Ooh. Not today. Oh, he's such a tough target. Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. What? to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh boy, he is rolling. Wait a minute. Oh man, incredible impact. Some of his speed there. He's looked beautiful, Centon. No doubt about that one. 
He's got some fight left in him. It's going to take more than that. Look at this. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Oh, boy, he is rolling. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Nailed it. No, there's the reversal. Running power slam. The champ's starting to falter a bit. He's always up for a challenge, and tonight is no different. This match is trending in a bad direction for him right now. Harsh impact. He might just win this thing right here. This could end it in a hurry. Power bomb! The challenger's championship dreams are fading quickly. He may very well be on Dream Street right now, guys. Big elbow. Toss to the outside. He's playing with him now. He's almost got him. Look at this. Very difficult position to be in right now. Yeah, situations like this usually don't end very pleasantly. a human being tossed like that. Looks as though the champ has run out of gas. I wouldn't be surprised if he just passes out right here. WWE.com poll had him as the overwhelming favorite leading into this match, but he's definitely not looking like the favorite so much right now. Clearly, they're both running on fumes right now, and at this point, it might just be a matter of which superstar's tank reaches empty first. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Oh, what impact! Here's the pin, title on the line! Two! And he's able to get out. Just when you thought it was over, wow! Uh-oh. Here we go. Here we go. Here's the pin title on the line. Go. Two. Three. Yes. Unreal performance. Here is your winner. And still world heavyweight action champion. G minor. Big win here, guys. Hey, they both gave it their all, but in the end, we were left with the best man standing. I couldn't agree more. What an amazing contest that was.